hope you guys are having an amazing day. For today's video, as you guys can see by the title down here, I'm going to be showing you how I prep my skin for my foundation routine. It's just, I'm just showing you the products and the steps that I take so that my foundation and my makeup looks flawless and last throughout the day. Before we get started, please don't forget to subscribe and the little button down there. And if you wanna know how I prep my skin, then just keep on watching. So as you guys can see, I just got out of the shower. I had to wash my hair today. And I actually, as you guys are going to see right now, and I'm going to put in the clip right now, I like to start off, obviously, with a really clean face. I am using my Foreo Luna Play, which is the tiny one, the one that is, like, battery operated. I just got that one, like, I want to say a couple weeks ago, and I have been loving the way that my skin feels right after. I paired that with my um, Cetaphil Daily Facial Cleanser. I almost forget the name. And that's how I cleanse my face. I have something in my eye <laughs> and after that um, my skin is ready to go and right now because of the winter and kind of like the season that we have here in San Diego um, it's a little bit more on the dry side um, this is like my favorite moisturizer I actually use it like every day even uh, when it comes like spring and summer it's just I find it that it's not greasy it's just perfect for my skin I totally recommend you get a sample so you can try it out I do have combo skin and that means that I tend to be normal skin kind of like in the outer part of my face and when it comes to like the center of my face, I'm oily. Before I go in with any primers or anything, I do moisturize my face. Although I do have combo slash oily skin, um, I still moisturize my face. And this is the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream. And this is for intense hydration. Um, it is used to help hydrate skin, parch skin, temporarily helps relieve minor relief minor irritation and itching due to eczema and other conditions. I don't have any type of um, skin conditions, so I just use it to like moisturize my face. What I really like about this moisturizer is that it gets sink to the into the skin really fast. Next, um, I actually ran out of my um, sunblock. Which recommend wearing sunblock it is so important you actually can get sunburn on your face so i totally recommend putting on some some sunscreen um before your foundation before any other products so after my moisturizer i apply um a, a sunscreen but i just actually run out so next would be the sunscreen i'm gonna go in with my milani um prep hydrating mist and this is the rose water and i'm gonna take this and just spray my face so after that, I give myself a couple minutes for it to like sink in my skin. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and prep my eyebrows and I'll be right back. I prepped my eyebrows as you guys can see. Next, I go in with my Jeffree Star lip scrub and I have mine in strawberry gum. And I'm going to exfoliate. I just remove it. I'm going to apply just Carmix uh, Classic Lip Balm. Um, I actually want to pick up the sugar lip treatment. I used to have that one. I'm going to go in first with my Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Primer. And I have mentioned this primer so, oh, so many times. And as you guys can see, I have a little bit left. This helps my makeup stay in place for the longest. And I'm going to apply a little bit on my cheeks. I usually use like two like one and a half pumps to cover kind of like my whole face and I apply this all over this is like glue so it's like a little tacky and this is gonna help our makeup kind of like get like glued into our face <laughs> if you have really dry skin I definitely recommend using another like um, kind of like moisturizing primer if you don't have any trouble like with your makeup kind of like disappearing I totally recommend using a more hydrating primer and then as you guys know I'm gonna go in with my favorite um, kind of like uh, filling pores primer this is the elf poreless putty primer and I use this on the daily I have used poor pre uh, professional from benefit I've used many like um, pore filling primers and by far this is like my favorite I know they came out with a matte putty primer which is like poreless as well and I heard really good things about that one, but obviously I do want to finish this one because it does a great job before I actually buy the other one. I'm going to apply it kind of like in the apples of my cheeks. 
and I'm just kind of like patting this in and then I take a little bit on my chin next I'm gonna go in with my Milani hydrating mist again and kind of like just applying a little bit and it's ready to apply my foundation. So that's it for today's video on how I prep my skin. I really hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe in the little bit down there. As always, the products that I use in this video are going to be linked down in the description box. And until then, I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye!